What is the first thought you have while purchasing a smartphone? Let me guess, how clear the front camera is for daily TikToks and stories on Instagram? Let's face it, nobody thinks of security while purchasing any phone. Everyone buys for two reasons. One would be its amazing camera capability and the speed of operations on the phone. We all care more about the apps, design, and status quo before we even think about the security. But wait a minute, hasn't Apple paid people already that have hacked their systems in the past? You're right about that too. Earlier this year, Apple paid Ryan Pickren $105,000 as a hack bounty, as he was able to hack the camera of a MacBook. Apart from this, there have been other companies and groups that work together to hack Apple to avail this hack bounties. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. And today, let's find out how the strongest feature of the iPhone can also be broken. Do you think the iPhone can be hacked from a mile away by using a cable? The content in this video would simply blow your mind out on how far technology has come. It's like a Bond movie come to life. When the question arises of the security of your smartphone, the operating system you choose plays a big role. How the operating systems are designed and maintained goes a long way in determining how secure your phone can be. The security offered by leading smartphones is different compared to the others. As we all know, the iPhone ranks first regarding its security. If so, what is this video about? Can a cable hack the user's data too? From a mile away? Quite interesting, right? In the past months, iPhone users have been through quite a lot as new forms of security threats arise. With all the exploited hacks, endless app store scams, and CSAM debacle, things are getting worse with the security. Apple quality and security has just been deteriorating. Vice reported that a security researcher named MG was responsible for creating a lightning cable that hides a chip within it and can record whatever the user types. You may be typing the password to your bank account or getting into social media, and you are allowing this chip to collect information and transit it to a device to which it is connected to remotely. The chip can relay this information simultaneously and help the hacker get into the accounts and do as they please. The next-gen version of the OMG cable, which has targeted many Mac users, is currently on sale. This means anyone can purchase it and have their eyes on the iPhones next. And you don't even need to be in the same vicinity of the main device. You can be a mile away at your comfort and do this. Isn't that scary? It looks like your regular lightning cable and works like it. But in reality, this is a malicious cable that can record everything a person types and wirelessly send this data. The creator of the OMG cables commercialized this. And what he was able to build in these new cables is quite extraordinary. As soon as these cables are connected, they create a Wi-Fi hotspot for the hacker, and an interface can be accessed with the help of an ordinary web browser such as Safari, Google Chrome, or Firefox, then allows the hacker to begin recording the keystrokes the user is inputting. But all of this is just the first gen of the cable. The second gen of the cable has all of this and also adds geofencing, which allows the hackers to trigger payloads on a device based on its physical location. The creator MG also said that the cable pairs with the self-destruct feature. If an OMG cable leaves the scope of the engagement and you would want your payloads leaking or even being accidentally run against random computers. He even went on to say that they tested this cable in downtown Oakland and they were able to trigger payloads at a distance of over a mile. Isn't that crazy and fascinating at the same time? MG also reassured everyone that the cables had successfully hacked the USB-C. And even people said the Type-C cables were safe from these kind of implants as there isn't much space. Where are these people now? MG even said that they had to prove all of them wrong and thus created the cable. The combination of the USB-C cable and the Lightning OMG cable puts iPhones at a big risk now. The cable has a small implanted chip, and if you look at them physically, they are pretty much the same size as the authentic cables, which makes it difficult to be identified as a malicious cable because the implant itself takes up more than half of the length of the USB-C connection's plastic shell. The Type-C cable allows the same attacks that can be carried out against any smartphone or cable. The maker even reported that there are various other improvements, including the ability to change the keyboard mappings and the ability to forge the identity of specific USB devices and pretend it to be a device that leverages the system's vulnerability. When Apple was asked about this, they did not respond to it. 
The set of cables provided by MG to the motherboard for testing also includes a black USB-C to USB-C cable, which would be designed specifically to mimic cables related to different non-Apple products. The current pandemic also complicated the manufacturing process for the cables. The pandemic made it a really difficult process, which made it more difficult with a shortage of the chip. Even if a single component is not available, it will be impossible to find another replacement for it, as every fraction of a millimeter is important. The company would have to wait more than 12 plus months for certain small parts to be in stock. MG said they would easily lose about $10,000 while testing a process change. While there is a chip shortage, it would be hard not to look at a loss and see many dead components that would be replaceable for over a year. A lightning cable conducts about 12 watts of power, which is quite adequate for charging your iPhone, iPad, or Mac. The same power is enough to charge a transmitter, implanted into the fake lightning cable by the hacker. The cable is sold freely on the internet for $120, and no one can track how many of these were sold to shady individuals. The OMG Lightning Cable to USB-A cable is more of a hacking tool that is almost indistinguishable from the regular cable sold by Apple. In 2019, MG showcased the OMG cable at the DEF CON 2019, a hacker conference. In 2021, MG developed the OMG Keylogger cable. The name pretty much suggests the cable function as a keylogger hacking instrument. By replacing the detachable keyboard cable with the OMG keylogger, cyber criminals can easily collect about 650,000 keystrokes, allowing them to collect login details and other sensitive data. We suggest that you carefully examine your cable before purchasing it. The Apple cables are certified with the MFI badge on their packaging. The original cables have a 12-digit serial number with the words designed by Apple in California, assembled in country. You should carefully examine the cable connector. And if you even spot an uneven metallic finish, rough edges, or varying insulator width, then you are dealing with a fake cable or maybe even the OMG cable. Do you know how to find out if you are being hacked? Don't worry, we'll tell you. If you are using a Mac, you will notice a sudden spike in your network activity, which the activity monitor can easily track. Another way is by checking the suspicious users in system preferences. You would also notice unsolicited software installed. The terminal would open randomly pop-ups that would unexpectedly request your login details. Well, at the end of it, we only suggest that you use your cable everywhere and avoid using unknown cables, as you wouldn't know what you would get into. We hope you would carry your wire everywhere to ensure safe charging. Would you ever buy the OMG cable and use it? And what would you use it for if you do? You can let us know in the comment section below. To stay updated on the latest hack, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel.